The good vibes continue up at the Kia training ground. Toronto FC fresh off their sixth win in a row, looking for number seven this Friday night against the New York Red Bulls. Gareth Wheeler with you. The team back at full training after a couple days off. And it was more of an injury report day than anything else for the head coach, Greg Vanny. Nick Haglin, among the big names dealing with injury right now, suffering an MCL strain in Saturday's win over Minnesota. He'll be out 8 to 12 weeks, but according to the head coach, it could have been much worse. The ACL is fine. No surgery required for Nick, but he has welcomed his new knee brace, Jerry, into his family. The best of luck to Nick in terms of his recovery. And Sebastian Javinko out three weeks with a quad strain. He's suffered the same injury before. Three weeks isn't long term, but they're going to proceed with caution with the star striker. In other injury news, Jonathan Azoria will be back at training on Wednesday wearing a heart monitor. They're going to watch and monitor him over the next few training sessions to determine whether the player was just ill or whether there's something that needs correcting. So stay tuned on that one. Jason Hernandez back in full training as well after dealing with food poisoning, which made him come out of the game after 45 minutes on Saturday. Now some good news on the injury front. Drew Moore continues to be back in full training. He could be a go for this Friday night against the New York Red Bulls. It's just all about match fitness at this point. So with no Javinko and no Nick Haglin over the short term, I asked Vanny during her sit down one on one whether it re would require a change in approach for the team or whether the changes for Haglin and Javinko would be like for like within the team. Anytime a player goes down, you know, those two notwithstanding it, it you feel it. Uh, but it's what we've learned over this stretch, which is what I believe before, is we have a very deep team and we have guys who can step up and, and do a job and do a great job and, and are good enough to help this team continue to win games. So there is some variation in that, but it's, it's trying to fit our pieces together in an appropriate way for, you know, for the match. For more with Vanny, go to torontofc.ca for my one-on-one -on -one sit down with the manager. He'll tell you why he hasn't changed his match day suit in quite some time. I also go one-on-one -on -one with Benoit Sheru and Toss 8 Ricketts. Speaking of Ricketts, congratulations to the Canadian striker. He makes the MLS team of the week, three goals in the week, including two match winners. The manager, Vanny, also leading the way in terms of head coach of the week in Major League Soccer. Also go to MLSsoccer.com. Alex Bono up for save of the week. Show the Toronto FC goalkeeper some love. Give him some votes. Keep it locked to Toronto FC on Twitter all week long. Our keys to the match coming up as TFC travel to New York to try to make it seven in a row.